What is up, guys? It is Layback Gamer, and we're here back in Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. Gotta remember that. Most important part, 2015. Anyways, we're back here in Car Mechanic Simulator, and in this episode, we will be finishing up the Bolt Hellcat, the full restoration of this car, which means what will we what we will be doing to this car is not only the body, but also the underneath of it, the whole steering and the braking system and just the all this stuff see see all this stuff all this stuff even the mufflers and yeah so we will be doing all that in this episode now this may take a bit longer or may not I mean it's kinda easy kinda hard so yeah let's just get right into it anyways now let's just get started with getting rid of these old ass rims don't worry the tires stay but the rims, they go. They are dog shit. So, which who knows, we may even change the rims if we don't like them. So now, let's just start tearing this thing apart. And it's kind of repetitive, but it's nice because it's like, yep, I know what I'm doing. It's not too hard. So, yeah. Let's just get right into it then. Now, let's see get these rubber bushings out which is probably the worst part because I hate them and then which I will be doing the exhaust or I will be doing the body last but the exhaust also lasts which I mean I'll be doing that right before the body so yeah let's just continue taking this whole thing apart get the wheel hub cap get the wheel hub and then the sway bar end link and then the actual sway bar, see? There's a lot of stuff that is involved, you know? So we'll just do all this. Now I do it a little different than some people, most likely. They may not do the same that I do it. But I'll do it, I'll do the entire front first. And then I will do the entire back after that. So I kind of keep it separated, but nice. So yeah. Now we're already done with the front, so let's just go repair what we can and buy everything else. Alright, now a lot of things you can't really repair. So yeah, and there's no performance shop items. So just letting y'all know that. In case y'all have never played the game before. If we want to buy wheels, we can buy any of these. Which I kind of like these. So yeah, we can buy any of these. Or, actually that don't look too bad either. But there, I had badass right there. Or these. So, that's not too shabby, but yeah. Now, let me go and buy some brake pads. I know that's something that we'll need. Need these. These. Um. Yep, 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 yep. I forgot half the stuff. These, these, these. I I just repaired some stuff, but now I'm just buying it all. Cause why the hell not? So yeah, we'll just do that. Make it nice and easy. And yeah. All right, now that I got everything that I think we needed, let's just start putting everything on. There we go. Which I will probably end up needing more stuff. I don't. Always remember everything. Like, there we go. That'll be something that I need. But uh, hey. I mean, you just do what you do. And if you can't do it all, oh well. Alright? That's what you should do. Not really, actually. You should probably try to get everything done. But hey. Oh well. But I can just tell them, deal with it. And then there you go. You're good. Don't actually do that. Trust me. Don't. Just, just don't. Anyways. Back, let's get back on topic here. Let's just finish up this wheel. Which, before I do that, I gotta put in the rubber bushings. Because it can be picky. I do not like these rims, so I'm gonna actually buy new ones. So I'm not, I'm not putting the rim on. I'll just start on this side. Those I will do last. So, but the slicks that I bought, because they did cost $4,000 they will stay now I do need an upper suspension arm so I will be buying that in a second when it's fully needed 
So, yay! Stalling as much as I can! Yay! Anyways, let's just do this. Oh, my bad. Excuse me, guys. And then this. And then this. And... This bot. Upper, that's way down here. Um... There it is. Alright, I had to find it. And there we go. The whole front is done. Except for tires, of course. But the front is now done. Sell all that shit. And then now let's work on the back. So, yeah. Alright, now I got the rear drive, or solid rear drive. Now this is not as much work to do, but there's just... S some uh, smaller parts that are can be annoying so yeah and then drive shaft needs to be taken off all right and then the fuel tank you gotta for can't forget that see fuel pump fuel tank all right now back to our original plan let's get it's like these little things are probably the most annoying the leaf spring plates and the u-bolts and all that then the fucking rubber bush ain't God damn it. They're they're not nice. I'll just let y'all know that. So uh someone just texted me. Fucking hell. Why? This is not a good time to be texting me right now. So yeah. Anyways, just keep going. Man, this was really fucked up. Hey look at this. We're almost done. Sweet. Now we do this, this, and this, and um, if you guys want to see any more Car Mechanic Simulator, or even other games, just let me know, put down in the comments and all that. So, and now, we're finished with all the goodies. So, let's just go here, repair what we can, and yeah. Alright, got the rear drive axle in, and we need a fuel tank. Now there's one thing we need from the performance shop, and that's fuel pump. So let's just quickly go and grab that. Wherever the hell it's at. There it is. Let's put all this stuff in. All the stuff. Oh shit. Nope, nope, nope. Get get the fuck out of here. Let's put the drive shaft in, all the stuff we don't need to worry about. And yeah. So let's do that. Alright now. We get back to the main stuff. The main stuff we were looking at. You know. I'm going to need that and that. Whatever two things I put on. Alright. Let me just buy them real quick. Nope. Wrong shop. I need a rear drive solid axle. Where the hell is that there? And then also. Something else. There it is. Alright. See it's nice just getting everything. Brake shoes. Oh, shit. I didn't know you could repair brake shoes. Oh, brake drums you can't repair. You know, it's one of the brake things, you know. It's it's just something you do. Alright. What the fuck? Did I really buy the wrong thing? Damn it, man. Don't you hate it? Brake drum. There we go. Damn it, man. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Wait, do I need that? Yep. Alright. Yeah, I just... I just gotta get my facts straight, alright? Before you judge me. Alright. So, yeah. We didn't have springs. No, we did not. What did I need? Small. And a leaf spring. Thing. Yay! Tiredness! Yay! Alright, now let's get all this ready over here. And then this. Alright, now, plate. We have enough plates. And we should have enough U bolts. So, if that, yep, if that's correct, which it is, we don't need to buy any more parts. Yay! It's nice not having to buy any more parts. Yay! Alright, brick shoes, brick drum, 
new spring, rubber bushings. What's up? Sorry guys, this may be a little painful, but we're almost done with it here. Alright. Alright, leaf spring plate. And the final two pieces of the puzzle. U-bolt and U-bolt. Alright, now since we're done with that, sell all that. Let's go into the shop and buy us some rims. I want these. Yeah, that was nice and easy. Look at that. Oh, yeah. That's what you need right there. Get you some nice shiny rims. And we'll buy them. Alright, now let's crawl down. Oh, no. Come on. I know you want to. There we go. See, I'm trying to crawl to the front. Doesn't always work. There we go. Now, since we got this all hooked up. And for the final piece. The last one. Yay! We are done with the whole steering column. Now, what we need. Let's fix this damn exhaust. Because look at this shit. Alright, we need two rear. Um, two middles. And... Oh, over here. Fucking hell. No. I need this. And two fronts. Now, for this... We can go to the performance shop. So let's get two fronts, two middles, and two rears. Alright, now we are a okay. Look at that. Look at this shiny chromeness. I mean, just look at it. Oh, baby. We are high class now. High quality material. And there you go. We have a fully rebuilt car, and as you see, everything here is all 100%. Now, as you see, let's move it right to the center so we can see it all. You may be saying, well, it looks pretty fucking shitty. That's all about change, alright? So, let's take off all the doors, the trunk, the headlights, there's no bumper on it. Or the rear lights and the headlights, fenders, headlights, no front bumper on it, no other headlight, and there you go. Now what we will do is repair the body, repair body frame, $1,500, look how shiny and clean that is. And then let's pull up our tablet and go to the body part shop, bolt hell cap, bumper, door, fender, door, fender, hood, headlight, tail light. Rear bumper, headlight, tail light, trunk, and rear bumper. And then we put it all on. Come on. Which I can also put like, if I wanted like a painted bumper, I could put that on, but no. You see this car? It's classic. It needs chrome. And for the final piece of the puzzle, well, bam! And now, uh, if you did not notice last time, before we finished the body, it went for $35,000. Now it goes for $60,000. But we ain't done here. We're going to take this thing into the paint shop and find a nice shiny color for it. I actually have no clue what I want to do on it. But we're going to figure that out. Since it's a muscle car, maybe red. Maybe blue. There's not many colors here. I'm thinking, huh, this is kind of a little tricky. What if we did maybe, no, eh, green, actually we could do a green, let's, let's try that, let's try green, let's see what it looks like, oh baby, oh man, look at that, we got the green machine, that's what I'm calling it for now on, and if you don't like the color, well, screw you. I'm keeping the color. Alright, now let's just do a test run. Because I might need to retune it. Uh, nope. But it might have gotten a little more horsepower. Let's see. Let's retune it. Yeah, we need to retune it. Alright, and then... Well, bam. 
bam, 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 bam. One last go. And set the carburetor. Now let's test run it again. Alright. Alright, still 330. Alright, I just had to check it, you know. You never know. So let's go back to the garage. And let's take the green machine out for one last run. Hold on, let, let's get a nice photo for this. And whoop, bam. Look at that, a green machine. Let's take it out for one final run on the test, or on the drag strip. Alright, now that we got the drag strip all loaded up. Oh, baby. Look at that. Holy shit. This thing gets offline pretty nice now. There we go. Still got a four second zero to sixty, but oh well. And about a very similar run. But let's just do it one last time, you know, just for the hell of it. Alright. It's a final run with the baby. There we go. Alright. And actually might have done a little bit better. We did a little bit better on 0 to 60 that with last run. Yeah, we did a little better overall, so I ain't complaining. What do we hit? 225. I saw 227 kilometers an hour. So if you know how many miles an hour that is, go ahead and put it in comments. Alright. Now since we fully finished the car. We have nothing else to do with it. I'm not really going to keep it because I'm not going to use it anymore. But we'll just admire it one last time. Look at our baby that we've worked on. You know, I mean, just check everything out. And yeah, we're going to have to say goodbye to the green machine. And now, what we will do is sell it. $60,000. Which, I mean, I've gotten better for. But hey, it's money. Now, I'm going to end the episode here. We finished everything. And yeah. If you want to see other stuff or more stuff, like, comment, subscribe, do all that stuff. I will see you guys later. Lay back, camera out. Peace. I was on the way to your crib, girl. I know you stay in Jersey. Why you lie about where you live? Rarely ever leave Brooklyn. It's your ass that got me here. Got you arching, got you golden, like we bringing back the real.